Hello everyone, and welcome back to Never Ending Nightmares for Part 5. Now, let's see if we can do what we did before without getting a giant knife through the chest. So, off we go. Um, I'm not exactly sure where this bedroom will be placed. Is this anywhere near where we died? Maybe? That could be the door I didn't go through last time. AKA, this could be the corridor I died in, so let's find out. If not, I'm at a little bit of a loss. Well, certainly seems like a long corridor. I probably could start running, but I don't want to run into another knife, so... Here we go, yep. There we go, there's my sister. Wanting to get revenge, but this time I'm not going to run left. Right, so I'm kind of screwed here. Are there two of them, or does she teleport? I'm not hearing her on the right. I think she just teleports. Right, okay, we didn't make it this far before. This is all new now. Great, fantastic. Let's go. Down again. <laughs> I still haven't, like, perfected my theory on this game. I'm still not exactly sure what's going on. Okay. No. No, 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 no. Oh, fuck. Go, keep going, keep going. Need to find some light, quick. Quick! Do I? Isn't there something lurking in the darkness that kills me? That sends me back to my bedroom? Maybe not this time. I seem to be fine. Weird. Okay. Well, I can just about see where I am. <laughs> in the little hints of, of white. Whoa. I must have walked into the death corridor. I hate when that happens. Okay, so she's like tied up, chained up. Why? What does this mean? Maybe I'm looking too deeply into this, trying to find meaning where there is none. I... We just still... Ah, oh, no! Almost did it again, almost ran into her! I'm just gonna walk calmly away. Is she gonna teleport to the left? Uh, not yet. Oh, damn, I I really hope there's no other monsters, like, to my left or my right, to be honest. Like, no people in straitjackets, no roided-up baby men things. Maybe she gave up the chase. <laughs> it's kind of hard to tell. I hope I'm not missing doors and stuff in the background. I uh, just, I really can't see anything right now, it's just more or less black. Let's just keep going. I think she's gone, yeah. Did I just go through a transition? The camera seemed to stop abruptly. That was kind of weird. Alright. <laughs> okay. I find myself in the asylum again. Somehow. <laughs> um, the nightmare is definitely getting worse. This man definitely does have some problems. But why? What? She's... What was wrong with her? It's like she was giving birth or something, actually, in that position. How old was she, though? She Wasn't she, like... I saw it on the gravestone at the beginning. I think she was, like, 10 or 12 or something like that. It wasn't that old. I... I oh, come on. Oh, no! No, no! Oh. That was the meat that I saw last time, you know, like back in part one. And I can't believe I wasn't like yelping in pain at that, I was just sort of quietly sobbing. Oh, <laughs> there goes my fingers. Uh. <laughs> Shifty eyes there. Right, let's, let's just leave and see what happens this time. So it seems that there are some inevitable deaths you do need to go through. And apparently I have been missing out on some pretty interesting death scenarios, like um, by not being killed by the baby men, for instance, yet. There's probably something specific there. So I kind of want to see the deaths, but I kind of don't. Okay, back in the bedroom again for the umpteenth time. Still says murder down there. Alright. 
It's just every time I go through uh, a different segment of this dream, there's another little addition to the music. And this time it's just... just offbeat, just off-tune, it's just a little weird. I really do like the music in this game. The audio in general. Alright. Oh, the wardrobe again, eh? Okay. We're gonna be um, we're gonna be hiding again, aren't we? Is there a baby man in this corridor? I'm not hearing any footsteps. Let's try this door. Oh, here again. Okay. Any changes? The dolls have gone. I notice it actually looks relatively normal. Yeah. Nothing really too disturbing in this room. Not this time. Okay, into the darkness once more. Wasn't there a grandfather clock not far from here? Maybe in this corridor? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> There's a doll. Like this. Is this another one that I can... Yeah. Another portrait I can actually use. What is that meant to be on the table there? Ashtray, maybe? Something like that? Hmm. Okay, alright. At least there's a way down. I was just noticing a distinct lack of wardrobes. Come on, Thomas. You can do it, mate. You can do it. Okay. Is this new? Probably not. Let's go. At least, you know, I can probably run now because I can see where I'm going. What the fuck? This is definitely new. We're we just like walking, walking out the side of the ruined house into the forest again. Right, towards the graveyard? Sure, why not? Why not? Oh shit. There she is. She hanged herself. Did she hang herself? Maybe that's it? Maybe that's why I feel so guilty. No? Well, I I can't interact with her anyway, so I just got to walk past her. Mm, okay. There she's again. She just won't leave me alone. She's the focus of, the focus of everything. And again, I keep half expecting, by the way, to see this tree like reach out and grab me. <laughs> I kind of wish it happened. All right. This forest is a little bigger than I remember from the first video. What was this? Okay, well this is certainly new. <laughs> this is so strange. Wait, what? Back in the house again? <laughs> How did that happen? The cobwebs are back, I see. Right, let's let's have a look at this room. Where are we right now? Oh. The kids' room. Again. Oh. The veil. Well, at least you're happy to see me this time. Alright. Still murder. Yep. No door here, though. Weird. Where's that crying coming from? Maybe somewhere next door. I don't know. Mm, okay, let's put up a little bit of a jog. There we are. This room? What's this going to be? Right, the sort of storage area with the bird cages, the barrels, yeah. Nothing has really changed since the last time I came in here. I don't think. Let's just keep going. I haven't seen a wardrobe in a while, so I, I don't know if I'm hiding, really. Right. Sewing equipment, and yeah, we can go through it. This is a connecting room. At what point is he going to wake up? He's got to wake up at some point, right? That, that's got to be the end of the game, as soon as he wakes up. That's if he wakes up. Oh, come on! 
Ah, oh, I didn't think I'd run into broken glass here, and I don't think there's any way to avoid that either. This is... He's... He's really dealing well with the pain. Maybe it's because he knows, you know, it's a nightmare. Just a little bit of a flinch, and then oh, he'll just walk it off. Never really changing expression. Really does feel like he's been through this, you know, a lot. It certainly isn't the first time. It probably won't be the last. Look at that doll up there. Some pretty strong spiders, wow. Uh-huh. Alright, well, let's see where this goes. Is this a bedroom? Yes. This may be the same bedroom I started the video in. Maybe. <laughs> it's hard to tell. Alright. Well, my feet aren't bleeding anymore, so... You know, thumbs up there, and that's a good thing. Oh god, oh what?! You're meant to be in the asylum! Where? Oh, what? Okay, it, it's a very sort of thin corridor here as well, so... If he... Sort of zigzags all over the place, which he seems to be doing, fuck, this guy's gonna be hard to get away from. Oh, goodness gracious. Go to the back wall, please. Oh, shit. I'm this is as low as I can possibly be. Let's just see if we can pass by each other. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. Yep, yeah, that's it, mate. That's it. That's it. That's it, okay. And there's no glass in front of me? Nothing that's going to make me yelp in pain a little bit. No? Okay. Whew. <laughs> I get so tense when I'm passing by those guys. All right, down again. What level are we on right now? I haven't really been keeping track. There's been so many cases of just walking down the stairs. We'll be hitting the mantle pretty soon, I think. Oh, hang on. Oh. <laughs> so this is where the graveyard is now. Not at the end of the forest. Shh. Alright. Now let's see. I'm probably going to see her grave again, aren't I? <laughs> Whoa! Thomas, no reaction. No, just going to walk around it. No matter what. Nah, okay, let's... <laughs> <laughs> let's let's see if I can actually interact with her a little bit. No, I'm pressing space. No, it's not. Nothing's nothing's working. There she goes again. All right. No, still can't interact with her. Is she trying to hit me? <laughs> I guess so. And here comes the blood. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's all blocked off, so we're going inside this room no matter what. Of course, yeah, it's, it's this bedroom again. Does it have a connecting door? It does. Okay. To what? <sighs> unsettling isn't really the appropriate word for this game. I don't think that... But it is unsettling. But it's more than that. It just... It scrambles your brain as it's doing it, maybe. I don't know. Here again. Oh, bloody hell. 
Okay. Left. No, left is left is a wall. <laughs> Look at that cheeky chappy. Having a glass of scotch. Lucky bastard. Alright. I really hope I'm not missing too many details here. I really am just... I'm pressing space on anything that has colour on it. Excluding blood. I might be missing things. I'm just not sure. <laughs> I feel like I've been here before. Several times. Oh, look at that. It's the... It's the chicken. Right. Okay, there you go. First time really seeing her in the light. Okay, hopefully she's gone. <laughs> if she hasn't, I'm screwed. She's gone, hasn't she? She's gone. Okay, good, 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 good. She gives up far too easily. And there she is. She, she just keeps appearing in paintings in the background and stuff. <sighs> My biggest fear for this game is that we're not really going to get a solid answer as to what happened. And again, down. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what, there's meant to be multiple endings, so maybe you just get a hint of what happened, and maybe the other endings will tell you the rest. Oh, and now we're transferring over to the- oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> Could I have gone around that? No, I couldn't actually, so there's no choice. But yeah, we're, uh, we're in the asylum again. I guess let's check out the cells. It might be a, a futile task, really. I don't know if there's going to be any detail I need to pick up from any of the cells, or if any of them are going to be unlocked, but I think it's worth checking. All right, all right. The doctor's office, right. Can we actually get some treatment now? Because I really do feel I need it. Just take the arsenic, mate. Just just end it. Storage. Okay, well, let's have a look at storage again. That was a, that was a dead end. Some medicine in the cabinets and everything. Yeah, not much has changed. A bit more blood, maybe. Yeah. Okay. But, uh, that's it. Alright, we're moving on to Block C again. Ah, <sighs> hopefully this Asylum segment doesn't last quite as long as it did before, because that got a little bit boring, honestly, in my opinion. Oh god! <laughs> maybe I started running at the right time! Fucking hell, it's been a while since I've seen one of you! In there, now! Whoa! <laughs> I wondered about that. I wondered if they could fit down here, but no, I guess not. This is a safe-ish area. <sighs> we're reusing, you know, the same areas again and again now, and we're back in the house. So I'm thinking we might be approaching the end of the game pretty soon. Don't know. Since I last woke up, we've seen pretty much everything we've been through before. We're sort of just summarising what we've been through. And I'm none the wiser, I'm afraid to say. So much blood. That... that image of her in... on the hospital bed, that stuck with me. I don't know what that means. I figure it's all got to be symbolic, and... She's my younger sister, right? So maybe after she was born, or during her birth, uh, my mother died of blood loss or something? What are they meant to be? Organs? Intestines, I think, yeah. Right, okay, this is different. Something with colour. A bear, right. Her bear, I assume. Can I not take it with me? No? What's the significance of that, then? Maybe it was just her favourite teddy bear. <laughs> I saw you blink. Alright. You must have been in this room ten times already. Alright, we're gonna leave it for the tenth time. <laughs> or are we? I think we're just going round in circles.
Jeez. Oh, fuck. Is she gonna come after me? Because I like my intestines where they are, honestly. She's eating her own intestines. How does... Let's, let's just leave. Let's just leave. <laughs> right, back into the corridor. Yes. Oh, what the fuck? Let's not go right if we have a choice. Let's go left. Oh, we don't have a choice. Fuck. Always a wall. Alright. Um, I've fallen down a hole like this before. I don't want it to happen again. Kind of wish I had a controller now for this bit, because this looks like it's going to change planes a little bit, you know? Okay. Oh, I did it right. I'm just trying to move very delicately here. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm doing well. Alright. No! Oh, fuck! Did... Was that unavoidable? I really don't know. Anyway, we wake up again. Intestines on the dresser table. Just what I like to see. And only one way to go. Okay, it's got to be right again. So what is this, an extended storage area now? Oh goodness, I don't know. Um, let, let's have a look in this room. What the hell? Nice uh, Chelsea smile you got there. Okay, nothing more to see apart from my uh, my sister's face. I don't think. In here? All right, yes. Oh, is that a is that a pool table or something or a snooker table? Nice. Don't remember seeing that before, actually. Maybe I did. Uh-huh, yep, yeah, the rhino. I remember seeing those. Take the gun, mate, take the gun. Okay, we're gonna go this way. I'm just waiting for something terrible to happen to the candle again. <laughs> ah. It's the death corridor. On tenterhooks, wrapped up in chains. Bones, upside down. What? What do you want to tell me? Jeez. What did I do? I'm punishing myself so fucking much. This is unreal. Just, just, just go. Just, just go. Yeah, down again. Oh, wow. <laughs> Long staircase this time. The final descent, maybe? We can't just keep going down, can we? I guess it's a nightmare. Anything's possible. Alright. Wow, this is huge. Does it have an end? <laughs> Yeah, e uh, wow, that's a hell of a lot of blood. Is that blood? What? Yeah, I'm just gonna go upstairs again, I think. Uh, no, what was that? Seriously. I was inside a... Inside an organ? Inside something? Where... Okay, into the fetal position. Was that... Is that a womb? Dear Thomas, I'm leaving you. I'm sorry. You can't talk me out of it. I still love you, but I just can't be with you anymore. They're two different people. Losing our daughter was hard on me too. Oh my god. But I'm trying to move on. Your life didn't end, so why can't you live it? I hope you can get past this tragedy eventually. I really do. I guess this is goodbye. Love, Gabrielle. <laughs> Two different people. I didn't realize they look so similar. I guess he didn't realize. Oh, that's the end. Oh, okay. Well, that's one of the endings anyway. I guess he didn't realize either. So that was my wife in the bed. 
who's no longer with me, so I was just imagining that. My daughter did die. Okay, right. Mind exploding at this point, to be honest. Um. Okay, some more of that does make sense, but I think to really get the full grasp of the situation, I am going to have to play a little bit more and maybe get those other endings. I think there's two or three more. Wow, that's a lot of backers. Holy hell. It's going to take a while. Um, so yeah, I think um, this isn't going to be the last video, despite me seeing the ending. I think I'll play a little bit more, see if I can get the other two or three endings, and then make a special video after this, okay? Thank you very much for watching this little playthrough. Hope you enjoyed the game. See you next time. No! I can just about see where I am. <laughs> In the little hints of, of white. Whoa. This is so strange. Wait, what? Back in the house again? <laughs> How did that happen? That's if he wakes up. Oh, come on! Oh god. Oh, what? You're meant to be in the asylum! Probably gonna see her grave again, aren't I? <sighs> Whoa! Thomas, no reaction. Oh god! <laughs> Maybe I started writing at the right time. Fucking hell, it's been a while since I've seen one of you. In there, now! Whoa! <laughs> Maybe it was just her favourite teddy bear. <laughs> I saw you blink. Oh, I'm doing well. Alright. <laughs> no! Wow, that's a hell of a lot of blood. Is that blood? What?